Welcome to the Digital Health and Fitness Live Studio, sponsored by United Healthcare here at CES 2017. I'm Dr. Eric Eiding. With me, I have Davide Vigano from Sensoria. Davide, welcome. Thank you for having me. Thanks for being here. So talk to us about Sensoria. What's it all about? Well, the vision of the company is that the garment is the next ultra-personal computer. So we have been working for five years now to inject sensing technology into whatever people wear. And that's important from a medical standpoint because as you know very well, changing the human workflow is very, very hard. But we all wake up in the morning, we take a shower, and we put our clothes on, right? So wouldn't it be nice to turn these clothing items into biometric sensing medical devices? And it's really amazing, too. I mean, like, even the idea of wearables, it's like, it only works if you're actually wearing it. So it's, you know, you're, you're taking that reminder to actually put on your wearable out of the equation. I love it. That is exactly right. So the, the consumer appetite to wear plastic and steel is limited to the wrist. We all wear textile every day. Yep. And what we wear is an expression of who we are, right? So we should decide what to wear, and it's up to us, the geeks, to actually make what we wear meaningful and smart. Yeah, excellent. <laughs> you know, and I think of some of the clinical applications, but for example, you know, when, when we're seeing patients who have some movement disorders, so Parkinson's or Alzheimer's disease or multiple sclerosis, what are some of the, the, the clinical uh, uh, utilities of, uh, of using some of these de uh, devices? For people that have uh, gait impairments, like uh, the ones you just mentioned, uh, it would be extremely helpful, I think, from a clinical standpoint, to be able to assess their gait without taking the patient to the clinic. So what we have built is actually a, a sock with textile sensing, pressure sensing technology, which is a fraction of a millimeter thick. It's at the plantar area of the foot. So think about actually doing a Parkinson's patient gait assessment in yep. the future using a sock, and I'm not sure if uh, the camera can see this here, but we have a sock engaged that you see actually the pressure sensing technology engaging. Yeah. And, and so the cool thing is that I can actually assess gait speed and gait quality in the future without having or forcing the patient to, to come to, to the clinic. And I just sort of see the next horizon for that to be take a, a device like yours at Sensoria, couple that with a clinical trial, and then see what the utility of certain new medi medications is. And Eric, that's exactly why we're here. We, we are a, a, we're geeks, we're a technology company. We need help from the research community and the clinical community to actually do it right, right? So we don't want to do something that doesn't make sense and we want to do it right and safe for the patient. And so that's the type of collaborations and partnerships that we're looking for here at, uh, at CES. The technology is mature now. I'm, you can see we have a nine axis gyro that weighs eight grams that connects to three textile pressure sensors and can store data or, or send the data to the cloud. Amazing. Uh, think about rehab, think about fall detection and prevention. Think about MS, multiple sclerosis, or Parkinson's, as you mentioned. I think we could actually do, do well and do good. Great, excellent. <laughs> Davide Vigano from Sensoria, thank you so much for joining us. Thank I'm you. Dr. Eric Eiding here at the Digital Health and Fitness Live Studio, sponsored by United Healthcare at CES 2017.